NIST Special Publication 800-145. And this is the document that defines cloud computing. So I'm going to read this. I don't generally read my slides to you guys, so I promise you this is an exception rather than the rule. But I'll tell you, um, this is something that ISC Square quoted in their material. And I always feel like anything that ISC Square pulls out, puts in quotes and says, hey, this is important, probably is important. So I would pay attention to this particular quote. So it's a model for enabling ubiquitous, convenient, on-demand network access. So let's just look at that piece. Ubiquitous, it's everywhere. You can get to your cloud-based resources everywhere when you need it on time. You know, I've been using cloud uh, storage as a service for 20 years. You know, I'll email, I, you know, always email myself files so I could have access to them at home, right? So I could get to them anywhere. They were convenient to access. I didn't need special software. Um, on demand, it's there when you want it. So those are all good. This idea of shared pool of configurable computing resources, a couple of things there. Virtualization is what makes that happen. It's what allows us to take a system that provides computing, you know, processing, storage, memory, network, all of these elements and allows us to uh, parcel off individual sections of that to various uh, organizations, right? So it's virtualization that makes that next piece work, this configurable computing resources. Uh, can be rapidly provisioned, again, can scale. Uh, we call that elasticity, that ability to go up or down based on needs. Released, that's part of elasticity too, is I can acquire services, I can release them very, very quickly. With minimal management effort, you know, think about traditionally what it's taken for us to add another server to our network, right? That's a process. That's an ordeal. Now, it's just a matter of a click of a button, essentially. Um, and I can do that without going through my service pro provider, right? Self-service. So all this is good, good stuff. I feel myself getting excited the more we talk about it. This is great stuff. And this comes to us from NIST. They love NIST. ISC Square loves NIST. I would absolutely expect them to ask you anything in that paragraph is fair game. Understanding each and every piece and why it's significant, how it saves us money, uh, what the challenges are. And of course, we haven't really talked about the challenges yet, but I don't, I've never found ISC Square to be really intensive on which of the three elements does NIST special publication 800-145 state? So by that, I mean, don't spend all your time memorizing every single special publication and what it provides for us. There will be a handful of documents that I will tell you you need to know. But for this, I would just simply take this as per NIST, this is the definition of cloud computing.